pub at Heathrow Airport. We just had breakfast. How much was it, Alice? I think it was about £33, Alice said. But um, anyway, it was nice, very nice. So now it's on, it's on to uh, the gates and onto our plane. For those of you who remember the earlier New Year's videos, it's like a repeat of it here. Here's um, Isabel again. Hi, Isabel, you all right? Yeah, good, thank you. How are you? Yeah, nice to see you. You made an effort for the gang. Yeah. No party this year, it's just the Bacarises and ourselves appear ahead. Hi, Joycey. Hello. You all right? Very good, thank you. Here they are. Isabel, I leave them all over the place. We've been snubbed by the Gallagher's, so we're making our own entertainment tonight. Woohoo! You're right. I, can I, am. Like I can say what I want, it's my video. But it's better. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's better than my first teeth, you know. So we're leaving Susan's now. It's miserable. It's mild, but it's, you know, windy and wet. Anyway, off on the road again. The tree's all out, and we're in the, uh, what George calls the Ronans now. So we've been to see Paddy, and now I've had... Richard's made me the most glorious... I just want to say on camera, Richard's a fantastic sandwich maker. And I've had a most glorious uh, ham sandwich and a uh, nice um, Christmas cake. It's lovely here in the Joyce's. It's all quiet, no children. It's great. Look at that car, viewers, with the eyelashes from the beauty salon here. Very nice. Sean and I are in uh, Kimbara now. Yes, I did that. Going to Londres. Yeah. <laughs> that's the b and I'm just putting this into context. It's 2014 and that's on the market for 450 Christ, I bet they take 400 Still, hell of a house. We're in um, Claren Bridge today. There's a whole host of shops and uh, this is the Galway Road. Go that way you get to Gort. Go that way you get to Galway. So uh, this is where the oysters are. Pat Moran and all everybody is down there somewhere. We're, we're going to meet Fiona Murray. We're in Claire's tea room now in Kimbara. Uh, not in Kimbara, in Claren Bridge. With yeah. I've just had El Grey tea and cakes. Yeah. Now by Elizabeth's long, longest, oldest, <laughs> bestest friend, yeah, you can definitely Fiona Murray. Hi Fiona, how are you? Not oldest, but longest. <laughs> yeah, all coming Good. up to that awful age this year. 5-0. Mm. Mm, we've all been there. Never mind. You're looking well, you've very been... good on it. <laughs> Thank you very much, David. You're very kind. We'll see you soon. Hopefully, maybe in the UK one day. Well, we're coming over. Oh, um, yeah. yeah, well, uh, you... The fire is blazing. The oysters are being eaten by Paddy. We're all assembled in the drawing room here. How's it going? You're having a nice time? Yeah. Julian's here. Hi. We're all looking around. Hi. There you go. We will set for another lavish dinner in the Joyce household. Hi, Paddy. Hi. Good evening. <laughs> Elizabeth and Paddy, the two of them together there. Are you alright Lizzie? You're enjoying yourself in Ireland? Yeah. That's my main course, the pork. I don't know we have pork, but I'm sure it's nice here. <laughs> Homemade roulade dessert. We're all around the table now. Sean and Anne, Paddy, Elizabeth, Elizabeth, Richard. Hi Richard, how are you? Good, just want to say on camera what a lovely evening we're having, what great food we're having tonight. So far, so good. Absolutely, Wor definitely worth a trip from Kibara. All assembled now after dinner, chatting pleasantly. Sean, uh, Alice, e, and Paddy. All enjoying ourselves here. John, the, the night that you were here, that we had the whiskies. Remember the night with all the whiskies on the table? The Years ago. I mean, no, no. A few months ago. Right. Home so grand, and long a brave, and haughty race, honoured and sentinel the place. Life can be. The shadows follow me. Did Davis? No, no, no. Which is better. It's over now. Yeah, still going. I'll be on my way. Dream about the days to come. When I won't have to leave alone. About the times I won't have to say. playing the piano and singing now is the highlight of the evening. Richard's filming. Richard's filming me filming him. Sad inevitability about it, the Christmas tree is being stripped bare. By whom, we might ask? By Joycey, the hardest worker in the house. You can see why she's so successful viewers, she actually gets things done. Carry on Joycey. Are you alright? Very, very good. A bit sad though. Oh no. Never mind. There's always next year.
Hope. On the road to Kinvara now, it's so overcast and rainy, but I didn't want to, I wanted to stop and just show you the, uh, the flooding. Look at this, viewers. Look, that's the kind of flooding. That is not a lake, that's just flooding here. Jesus Christ, that comes on the road. This road will be impassable. Oh, I forgot to show you the car. I'll do it later. But um, see it, uh, diesel. I'll show you later. They are on, like bookends on that little sofa. Madness. Have you had a good time in Ireland? Yes. Fantastic time. Good. Now tell the viewers what you're doing now. I mean, what you're doing this evening. What are you doing? Uh, going on. Going, going to London. back to Stansted, Stansted Express, cross London, back home. There they go, the back of Reese's. Hopefully we'll see you again soon. Yeah. You're both of you now invited to come to Cavisham any time. Oh, thank you. <laughs> you're, you're both my favourites. <laughs> <laughs> Emily! Hey. He's a bit of a fatty, isn't he? Table set at Susan's for a quiet, intimate dinner with uh, Susan, Pat and Jean. Jean has, booked some, uh, has bought some oysters. Quite a few, actually. Let's go and see what he's doing with them. Sean, our viewers want to see what you're doing. What are you doing there? Tell our viewers about the oyster situation. I'm keen the oysters because they're white oysters. Right. These oysters have been picked, you know. Yeah. Uh, oh, my God. And should you be going like, to bed? Like, like the scallops the same yeah. Should be keeping it clean. Yeah. Returning the air car at Shannon. See it, Leon. A diesel. It's okay, actually. It's all right. Um, Top speed is 180 k's. It's kind of bland. I wouldn't have one, obviously, but uh, it's all right for a hire car. Um, they've got a big, kind of impressive entertainment system there. It's amazing how much things have come on, touch screen and everything, very high tech. But it's you know, a reasonable car, diesel. Second and third is good. Cheap, because 35 euros worth of diesel, so uh, very economical. So, based on the fear factor of ice on the road, we actually got to Shannon like an hour early. So we're having breakfast in the cafe, and <laughs> how much was it, Elizabeth? Do you want to tell me the price? I'm guessing 30 euros-ish, 9.50 for a cooked breakfast. 